Hello guys. Today we're going to be taking a one-shot look at this war of mine. This is the anniversary edition. Let's get started. I, I have already played to figure out what I'm supposed to do. I think I know what I want to do, but I don't. I don't know. I started out with these three. Let's go back to these three. We should start at day one. Yep. How long has this siege lasted? It's hard to say when every day is a struggle for survival. The city is cruel. Uh, sorry. The city is crawling with snipers. Sh snipers. Shell shelling is ordinary business. Almost every night. Bones don't work. There is a shortage of food and meds, and many people are left homeless. Bruno and Marco have always been good friends, so when the war broke out, they decided to stick together. They met Pavle, 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 while scavenging for supplies. He used to be Uh, Pekron's star football player. Now he's just another homeless victim of war. So they teamed up, hoping for the best. Alright. So this is actually a way different structure than I, what I just, was just messing around with. So. <laughs> Apparently all the structures, um, each time you start a new one, the structures are different. Cool. Randomly generated. So we're just going to have each person. What are you doing? Bruno. Ball. Ah, uh, did you want to see? Slightly wounded. Nothing. Slept and sit. Oh, okay. Let's get Pablo down here. See the fast runner. Come on. Okay, right click is to make it. Alright. I don't think we have enough resource. No. Okay. I know you feel. I know you're wounded. I need you. Find a little bit more lumber so that way you can actually get some rest. You sick. Marco. Yeah, so uh, this is a uh, side scrolling game. It's a, it doesn't look that bad. Nope, nope, nope. Sit back down. <clears throat> okay. okay, so we have a bed. Place it in here. gonna help. I'm gonna make 
all the beds. Actually, I want you in bed. You over here. Place it again. There. For another slightly limited, I don't think we have any bandages. No bandages. Okay, so right here is the food, here is the medicine. But I'll manage. And I'll get you some bandages tonight. Chief save you. I think this means doors are locked. So, uh, yep, doors are locked. On, on. Just do the rest. Slightly recovering, slightly sick recovering. You should feel better by the time it's nighttime. We actually need a lot more materials to upgrade the workbench, which is why we're going to be, which is why we're scavenging the house itself right at this moment. But during the night time, we're going to be scavenging other houses. So the last time I played, I went through three days, well, technically two, because on the third day I did quit. But I just wanted to get like a basic standing on this game before I actually showed y'all. I'm, I'm pretty sure many of y'all have actually seen it because it has been out for two years. I think it said two years, I don't remember. But the anniversary edition, I, I believe, said there was a free. What did. No. You go back to bed. Oh, seriously? No. You get these guys in order, man. I don't like how you, I mean, I guess I could do this, but it's just like, getting so confused. Okay, those two need to rest up. I do need to make another bed, but I think we'll be good for the moment. No one's hungry yet, so that's good. All right. It's almost night time, so we'll just let the time run down. Seven forty. So it, it, it feels like it takes five seconds to get to the next. Eight o'clock. All right, next time. Okay. Kind of want him. And I want him to stay. So I'm gonna have him on guard. And have him scavenge. I think I'll be good. So the last time, um, the second night, I actually got raided. So I'm, I'm, I'm getting a little better. I'm doing a little better already by putting someone on guard. Hopefully they don't get killed. 
gunpowder. Just take it off. What's going on here? So it's, I, I like this effect right here. Because you're not, you, it doesn't let you see everything like you, it does in the house. Which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna go down. That. I'm gonna be kind of cautious here because I did not look in here, which I really should have. Uh, it's just lumber, okay. I need to. I'll come back for that. Okay. Good there. Did you get you guys see that gunfire? Yes, I am being very risky here. Going up from the floor. Because someone could actually be here. Let's see what this is. A family photo of parents and two daughters. Good thing the girls don't resemble their father. He looks like a bear. Okay. I don't know how much longer I want to be in this place. And I, I ran out of storage, so... Alright. Running's not the best idea, because I will be found out real fast. Okay. I didn't find any bandages, but hopefully they were able to feel better and heal. Maybe. Hello. Uh, look at all this stuff. I wish I could could bring so much out. Uh, didn't get to finish. Things were calm that night. That's good. Hungry and tired. Hungry, slightly sick and tired. Hungry. <sighs> okay, y'all need to sleep. You. Can go eat. You. Can go to bed. Cannon fire. The ambiance of this game is real nice. Okay. Still hungry? Well, too bad. Don't have any more food. Hopefully, my other guys don't. Starve us, uh, die of starvation. That's what I'm trying to say. I think we'll go one more night, and then that should be it. I'm not gonna go through the whole day because we've already been through all that we can in this house. Everything else is blocked. Unless I want to go burning through these two, which I really don't want to. Let's see what I can make now. I can make a few more things. A chair. An armchair is a comfortable place for furniture. Piece of furniture, sorry. If you sit in it 
with a good book, you can almost forget about the war. I believe this is one real world hours, not game hours. Because seeing how seeing how crappy these are actually being made, I could see how it'd be just one real world hour. Oh my gosh. It's intense out there. Let's go over here. There's a couple of things we could look at. Look at me. Ooh, some food. Ooh, and a block pit. Let's see, what do we want to open? So. This thing, lockpick, self-explanatory, it will unlock the locked door. So should actually just open that up. Don't know why I didn't do that earlier. I would need another lockpick for this after that. So that's not worth it. Could use it here or borrow in here. Grab that. That might be the most plausible one. Using that efficient. Or I could just hold it for the night. Okay. Yep, still no reason. Ah. He's hungry. Let's feed him. He did go scouting last night. Still sick and he's recovering. Still hungry. These guys need a lot to eat. Too bad it isn't cooked. Aw. Oh, dang it. Okay. Yes, we do need food. Let's skip over to the night. You're gonna scavenge. Oh, uh, slightly sick. Yeah, he, he could still scavenge, he'll be fine. He'll be on guard. And let's take that with us. Let's see what else we could do in that house, because it's going to take us back to the same house. And it was blocked before, this isn't good. Okay. Not seeing anything. Oh, okay. So we have to do it from the other side. Nope, oh, come on. Down here. Here. Hold up. We'll leave that. I know we already searched through all this, I'm just gonna make sure I didn't forget anything important. Like food. Some of this. Okay. Take, take. Good book. Maybe we'll sit in the armchair. Forget about the war. That doesn't sound good. Okay. I'm really not being careful. A note that says, one, on the first day they robbed us. Two days later, they murdered our girls. I shot every one of them. But I don't want to use the gun anymore. It's broken and buried in the backyard. The next part really looks shaky. If you're reading this, don't look at me. Don't look for me. It's actually kind of sad. Um, 
I'm just gonna grab all of this. Slip in here. Let's go in. Now, if I use this lockpick for the worst reason, I am gonna be so ticked. Okay. There's a couple things we can look through. Tag. That. I want to drop that. Could drop that. Take that. Let's see what's over here. Ooh, medicine. Who needs a good book? Not us. And what's this? Her medicine. Shell casings, tomato, rolled up cigarettes. Oh, Too many things I want. Okay, one more thing. I believe this house is done. There is a rat. Can we get to him in time? I could really use a shovel. Shh. Wimp. Come on, just use your hands. That rat's just staying. Halfway there, come on, man. Got this. Hey, since you're slightly sick, we found your medicine. You could take that whenever we get to the house. I think this might be the back door to the backyard. Possibly. Back door, and we can't get to it because we don't have a lockpick. Uh, Alright, let's return home. Real quick. Come on. Get back safe. Day three. We're actually gonna end it up. We're gonna see how everything I did, and then we're gonna end it off. Look, I brought some meds. For you. Ah, oh, they were raided. Okay. Okay, so, so I'm trying to. I don't think they took anything. That's good, but Marco. Oh, okay. Marco is right there. Slightly Yeah. I bet you are. Just come down here and rest. You're hungry. Get some beds. You come up here. Sadly, we ain't got food. And then, 
that sure, but... <laughs> Look at those skills. Look at that, we're all frame. Alright. So. Hold on. Alright. This has been the Gamer K. Playing. Gosh, I, I already forgot what we were playing. Uh, no? Yeah, okay. This war of mine, oh my god. I can't believe I forgot that. <laughs> Alright. Hope y'all enjoyed. And if y'all want me to actually do a, a complete playthrough of this, or Try and do a complete playthrough. See how long I can last. Uh, let me know. Let me know down in the comments and show your support. And I'll see you in a different video. Bye.